What's going on guys? We're coming at you with a brand new video. We heard about this, so we thought we would try it, get it out to the presses nice and early before everyone else does it. Cause usually when there's like something new that's keto, you get bombarded with it, right? Yeah. Smoothie King, which I've never been to before. Me neither. I'm not a smoothie person. Especially not the ones that they make for you that cost like $7. I don't do that. And it's just like orange juice, right? And berries. But they have new keto smoothies. To my surprise, it's actually like pretty quality stuff. Yeah. It looks, looks good. Uh, they do use almond butter. And then Ooh. the only thing that's like, you have to do some digging to figure out what it is. They have a keto protein blend. Did you so figure it out? The keto protein blend is MCT powder and collagen protein. Wow, I'm into that. So there are two, the keto champ berry and then the keto champ coffee. And we're going to get both, of course. Of course. Um, the keto champ berry has blueberries, raspberries, the keto protein blend, almond butter, almond milk, and cocoa powder. And you can add more stuff to it if you want. You could probably add like spinach, stuff like that. And then the coffee one is coffee, the protein blend, almond butter, almond milk, and cocoa powder. So simple. We'll talk about these once we get them. I hope the place has them because I think these are brand new. All right. Let's, let's go. We'll be back soon. Oh, look. Right oh. there. Oh, yeah. Keto champ. Can we get two keto champs, please? Under 10 net carbs. Smells like um. B.O. and supplements. Doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Are they good? Nasty. <laughs> really? Yeah. So this is my first time in a Smoothie King, and the first thought that came to me was like, if I was on a road trip, this would be a good place to stop. Just look at like, just nuts. Protein bars, power crunch bars, so this is probably the only one. Oh, oh and Quest bars. Yeah. meat sticks. How much are they? There's 12.80 for two of them. Your butt's just basically in the smoothie. Good boy. Okay guys, got our smoothies and I didn't want to get the guy fired so we actually asked him and I was like, what do people think of these keto smoothies? Actually, I think what happened was we're like, we want the keto champ smoothies and he's like, are you, are sure? you sure? No one Have likes you? those. Yeah, he was like really confused as to why we're getting both. And then uh, he said basically people have gotten them, no one likes them, I've tried them, I don't like it. He said disgusting. Yeah. Then I was like, what's your most popular menu item? And he's like, it's the tropical surf. And I looked at it and it was, it was like mango, surf. orange, yeah, pineapple, kiwi. dates, kiwi, it's just like, yeah, I don't think you're gonna like the keto one when that's what you're drinking most of the time. Yeah, so I don't know if there's any sweetener in these, but their protein blend does have whey protein, mm -hmm. so that itself could have sweetener in it, but that would be the only sweetener, right? Probably, But yeah. there are like add-ons you can do, and stevia is one of the add-ons. Yeah. So if this isn't sweet enough, but you want it, you like it. How much was this? Both of them were like 1280. And he offered to fill this up to the top. I was just like, no, it's fine. We're just gonna try them. We're probably not gonna drink it all. No. Because that's what I was thinking. Like, this is easy to make at home. This is 430 calories. And they actually, like, this is pretty cool. They're doing some stuff. They're trying to help people, it seems. Um, they have all of these under 10 grams of carbs hacks you can do too. So we're gonna have a blog post on this if you wanna check that out. We'll include some of these hacks and stuff below. Maybe some cool keto smoothies that are not just like on the menu. They're like ones we created. 31 grams of fat, 23 grams of protein, 19 carbs, 10 fiber. And so was, nine net carbs. Nine net carbs for this one. And this one is the coffee one. 420 calories, 31 fat, 24 protein, 14 carbs, seven fiber. So seven net carbs. Yeah. So not bad. I think the fiber just comes from the almond butter, a little bit from the berries. Mm -hmm. And a little, I think cocoa powder is in each of them maybe. I can't remember. Okay. But Cheers. let's try. This one. Okay. I like it. That's good. What is it? Is that almond extract or like coconut powder? It's a little, so I think the protein powder is actually unflavored. That's the flavor I'm getting. So it seems naturally sweet then, right? Mm-hmm. I like that. I would drink that. I like it too. I don't think there's any sweetener in that. It's just like the almond this butter. This is not donut like at all. If I drank this, I'd be really full and I wouldn't need more. I take that back. Mega's right. That's good. I like that. It's not it overly sweet taste. at all. What does that taste I like? think it's just the unflavored the protein, protein powder. powder. Yeah. No. Yeah, that's that's a that's good. This is very good. And I like the macros. I really love that. The perfect level of sweetness for me. me too. I think most people would probably like it a little sweeter. So bring your own stevia drops or get the stevia powder they add. Now this, this is a keto be sweeter. Keto Champ Berry. Yeah, it should be a lot sweeter. That's really good. Phenomenal. Wow. What is this guy talking about? <laughs> 
I mean, this if if I this would be disgusting to me, or the coffee one would be if I drank normal smoothies. I wasn't planning on drinking these, but I think I might. These are delicious. I was, thinking, I was like, what are the macros again? And what kind of one yeah. I have it? <laughs> these are good. And the thickness, like, yeah, man, super thick. I love a good thick something. Yeah. Okay, on three, which one do you like better? One, two. Wait, so say coffee or berry? Okay, one, two. Three, coffee. berry. I want to keep That's drinking fine. coffee, but berry I think most people would like better. Oh yeah, you're you're gonna like this better, but for some, some reason the coffee one just really hits home for me. These are really good. I would come back and get this. I like this. <laughs> for like a quick lunch? I would definitely make some modifications, I think. Like I would like maybe leaving out the almond butter and like adding some other stuff. Like what? I don't know. The almond butter is probably what makes it really thick and good. Yeah. So maybe not. Because there's almond butter in both of these, right? Yeah, yeah. But you can add spinach. Yeah. If that's your thing. They have like an electrolyte mix powder. I yeah, I should have be. asked what's in that. So overall, how does this compare to what I was expecting? Vastly exceeded expectations. Me too. Especially when you ask the person yeah. what they think and he says disgusting. <laughs> like that, That's an intense word. I don't give out 10 out of 10s easily, so I'm not going to give this a 10. This is not a 10, babe. I would give it a nine though. Because it exceeded your expectations? Because the ingredients are really solid. Basically just textbook, check boxes, all everything good. So you can put keto on it and I feel good about you saying this is a keto champ smoothie. Yeah. Um, I'd give it a nine at least. Price obviously like it's a little price prohibitive. I think they're about six bucks each. Six bucks for 430 calories? I don't know. I can't rate it. I'm not giving it a nine. Maybe like a... People liked when I rated the Blaze Pizza because they were like yeah seven out of ten that's about right. So they like when we give ratings. Okay, I'm gonna say, yeah, no, I just wouldn't rate it a nine. I would rate it like. Mm. I would even say, like, throw a couple more shots of espresso in this, and then this really replaces, like, your Starbucks Frappuccino. I'm gonna go seven and a half. That's fair. This one is definitely, like, I don't think everyone would like this one. Everyone would like that one. But me and Matt like really weird tasting things. This I've is learned. a little chalky, like. I like that. I like it too. <laughs> I could see myself doing this. Like it, sometimes when dinner rolls around, I'm just like not that hungry. Yeah. Let's go to Smoothie King and get something delicious. And slowly sip on it, pour it into a bowl, eat it like ice cream. I wouldn't do that. That's what I would do. Good job, Smoothie King. Yeah, we're impressed. If you guys have tried it, I think by the time this video comes out, a lot of you will have tried it. Comment below what you think. Give it a rating. We've been doing keto for like five years, so it's hard to be in the perspective of someone just starting. Yeah, because just starting, this isn't going to be that delicious. Yeah, if you just came off a of pineapple surf yesterday, you're not going to go to like the coffee champ. Yeah. That's right, it, guys. guys. Check out the blog post. We'll be back for more restaurant reviews. See ya.